Hey guys, Camper Dad here. I decided to freeze dry some rotisserie chicken from Costco. I've seen others do it online, and so I know it can be done. But I decided to do it anyway here so that we would have some for our own food storage and because I wanted to try it, see what it was like, see how long it takes to do in the freeze dryer. I imagine there's lots of uses for it. Um, but I'll show you some of the pictures now of what it look, looked like before. One of the things that I did it for is uh, because I was trying to show an example to somebody of this is how a tray should be loaded to go in a freeze dryer and this is how it shouldn't be loaded. And so I'll show you those pictures right now. You can see I way, way overloaded one of the trays with rice and quinoa and big breasts of chicken. Obviously that's way too much. It was a little over the top just to show a little bit what it was like to some of the things that I've seen and questions I've had of, can I do this in the freeze dryer? And the answer is you probably shouldn't and it probably won't dry anyway. Even if it did, that big breast of chicken trying to rehydrate it later would be really, really hard. So anyway, I've got four trays of rotisserie chicken that I've broken apart and loaded. I'm gonna freeze dry them and we'll see what it's like when it comes out. You can see how I've loaded the trays here with chicken. The photo I showed you earlier showed four rotisserie chickens from Costco. I only got a little more than two and a half of that in. So I've got the rest of it sitting in the fridge waiting to go on trays to freeze, as well as the rice and quinoa that I'm gonna freeze dry. Also, I don't know how long this is gonna take. It's nighttime here, about 7.30. Maybe by the time I get home from work tomorrow evening, it'll be done or close to, we'll see. Okay, made it home from work. We are 22 and a half hours. Freeze dryer says to check the food. So it thinks it's done. I'm gonna see. I've got some warm water here because I want to reconstitute a piece just to see what it's like of the rotisserie chicken. Let me see what I can find here. Oh yeah, it's all very dry. <clears throat> I'm going to find a piece, drop it in there. There's some white breast meat. There's some dark meat from the thighs probably and I'll see what it's like just dry it's pretty dry but the flavor of the rotisserie chicken is still there so all this stuff I'm gonna seal up in bags and store it. This would be good in soups or casseroles. After that rehydrates, I'm going to see what it's like. But yes, it appears everything is dry. So I'll turn the freeze dryer off and let it warm up. I don't know if you can see there, these pieces of chicken that are all just totally dry, ready to be stored. 
That was a great experiment. Let me see how this is actually reconstituted really fast. And it tastes really good. That's really good. So try that one. Rotisserie chicken from Costco. You can see how I cut it down into pieces that are more manageable. It reconstitutes well. It tastes good and it dried in less than 24 hours. I'm really happy with that. That was two and a half full rotisserie chickens from Costco freeze-dried.